This is a Boogaboo Chameleon 2, and today we're going to show you how to remove a rear wheel when it seems stuck onto the chassis. This process is the same for the Chameleon 1, but it's different for the Chameleon 3. If you have a Chameleon 3, we have another video that shows you how to deal with stuck rear wheels on that model. So, the way this normally functions is that you squeeze in these two metal pegs, and then you can pull the wheel directly out. If, when squeezing these pegs, the wheel will not be removed, then uh, what most likely has happened is that this metal bent pin locking assembly sort of thing here has come out of alignment or become bent wrong. And in order to remove the wheel, you need to get each side of this out from a small groove where it locks onto the axle. So you'll see in the middle here, there's a little plastic wall. And when you bend this out, the pin is actually uh, angled inwards like an elbow and that slots right in through a little slit and locks in to the axle. Uh, what you're going to need to do then is to work this metal pin so that both of these angles, there's one on either side, are pulled far enough away from the axle that you can get it out. You don't want to just start hammering it out because you can damage the axle and you can damage the pin. What you can do instead is to use a flathead screwdriver in order to pop it up and pull it a little bit to the side so that that elbow does not fit into that slit. And you'll want to do that on both sides. I'm going to now take the wheel off in order to show you this uh, so that you can see a little bit better what you're working with. So, as you can see, this is one metal uh, pin that is bent in this special shape all the way around. And again, when I press this, it pulls those little elbows out from the sides. Uh, this thing can get bent and it can be the case that it has come out of alignment and one side is no longer pressing outwards. You can actually remove this entire piece and just reform it into the correct position. Just be careful not to break it. So it should look like this. Uh, again, sometimes it can be bent wrong. So you can take a, a couple pairs of pliers and just sort of refine all of the shapes, looking at this one in the video as a guide of how it should look uh, so that your elbows are correctly angled and so that this is a smooth curve and so on. And then when you have it shaped correctly again, the lower metal arch fits all the way under the plastic lip, and then these parts slide into the side under those two little walls on the sides. There. In this case, I twisted it so that those two lips are separated from each other. Now I'll find the right position and then pop them so that they all pop in place again. So in any case, that is how you deal with this faulty locking mechanism for the rear wheel on the Chameleon 1 or 2, and how you remove a rear wheel that is stuck to the chassis. We hope this video was useful to you, and if it was, we ask that you subscribe, as it helps us continue making videos in the future. Thank you.